guys, Max here for IGN. I'm at San Diego Comic-Con 2017. I'm at the NECA Toys booth. If you grew up, I don't know, in the last four decades, you probably experienced the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and NECA has been really killing it with their collectibles based on this wonderful, timeless, unkillable property. Uh, they've been doing these quarter-scale figures for quite some time now. This is how big they are. They are about 18 inches tall, and they'll run you about 100 bucks a pop, and they did kind of the four principal turtles, but it looks like they're adding more and more to that. They've also got Raphael in disguise with the weird trench coat and the baseball bat he uses to fight Casey Jones. And then, of course, you've got the baby pre-mutated turtles and a wonderfully detailed box of Domino's pizza addressed to a certain Mr. M. Angelo. Uh, that's not all they're doing, though. There's a lot more on the way. They've also hinted the fact that they're working on a Shredder and Foot Clan quarter scale figures, which are going to be coming out in 2018. Now, in other Turtles news, this is something that literally gave me chills when I saw it. Last year at Comic-Con, NECA's big exclusive was a bunch of action figures of the Turtles based on their Konami video game, arcade game uh, iterations, which had like kind of pixel art on them. In this case, they're doing some Turtles in Time figures. So you've got a Rock Soldier, Slash, and General Trag. General Trag is a pairing of words that is just very deeply engraved in my brain, and I hope we see more of the kind of you know, sort of D-listered Turtles characters. But that's not all. If you're unfamiliar, it's the 30th anniversary of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles cartoon, and NECA didn't pull any punches. Shredder, if you'll excuse me, I gotta go check something out really quick. And this is really the crown jewel right here, limited to about 5,000 pieces, some of which were sold online, the rest which are being sold at Comic-Con right here. This is an eight-pack of Turtles, Foot Soldiers, Shredder, and Krang, and they're all based on the original cartoon. There is so much wonderful just attention to detail here. Shredder has the retro mutagen gun. You might know it from an episode of the cartoon. You might know it from an, as an accessory the original toy came with. There's also the wonderful shell-shaped grappling hook up there, and they all come in this big collector's case. Now, what really sucks here, I asked about this, they aren't going to be breaking these guys up and selling them individually because of the mutated rat's nest that is licensing of IPs like Turtles, but it's really cool to see NECA making wonderful stuff like this. Now, if that wasn't enough, enough weird, deep-cut, just nerdy appreciation of a franchise. Their Aliens exclusive, this is a little bit of a walk, but bear with me. Their Aliens exclusive is kind of a nod to Turtles. Here we have an orange mutated sewer alien. This is Xenomorph who is neon orange with little bits of red. It's almost as though it's an alien that kind of looks like mutant pizza. Kind of like that one episode of Ninja Turtles. These guys are, clearly are big nerds, and you can see the amount of love they put into the stuff they do. So if this stuff strikes your fancy, check out NECA's work. They're a great company. And if you like the stuff that we do here at IGN, we've got lots more of it from Comic-Con. So stick around.